Hi there. Today we have the CareSense Kerbel Easy Release Seat Belt. We have two styles here at Blue Water Rest Home. The first one is a red and blue Easy Release, and we have a black and red Easy Release Seat Belt. The Quick Release Velcro Kerbel Belt is attached to the wheelchair through a bolt and screw. On each side, a hand width should be between the belt and the person at all times and align with the pelvis. To adjust the belt, we simply pull up on the top strap, making a looser loop and pulling tighter and back through. With the client in the wheelchair, be sure that the tab and slot align. This ensures that the alarm system sensor is blinking and that it will sound if unattached. Fasten, the client will first have to undo the first part of the hook and loop belt, remove the tab from the slot, which immediately sounds the alarm. The alarm will continue to sound until canceled or reconnected. To re-engage the Velcro release seat belt, place the Velcro together and ensure that the tab's alarm matches. As you heard, two beeps ensures that our safety alarm is back together properly. We have our Velcro release Easy Care Curbel um, belt alarm system. So fasten to the wheelchair with bolt and screw on each side and a hands width between for comfort and safety. To adjust the length of the belt, you're gonna to come to the side, to the buckle. You're going to pull up on the inside and the other side to make a loop. We're going to pull it tight from the bottom to tighten. Client in the wheelchair, be sure that the tab and slot align and that the alarm blinks as to the location of the belt. To unfasten, the client or caregiver will first have to pull on the red loop and detach the magnetic sensor from the slot, which immediately sounds the alarm. Three tones, beep, 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 and pause. To cancel, to silence the alarm, you press cancel or reattach the belt. To re-engage, simply line up the magnetic sensors. You should have two beeps and fasten the Velcro. Always be sure to test any alarm system before resident use to ensure proper function. If equipment and its components do not pass testing, notify registered staff immediately. Remember that these seat belts are essential for alerting caregivers sooner to reduce the risk of falls. These seatbelt alarms are not considered a restraint provided the patient can release them in an emergency. These devices have been implemented based on assessment of therapy staff. Thank you for watching.